All right, and also tonight we want to talk about some of the students. We know that, uh, kiddos, you've been out of school for days in yeah. some cases, but you're not just sitting at home, and many of you are stepping up and offering some assistance. Here's some video of Deweyville and Bridge City athletes teaming up to help out Deweyville coach Brandon Prouse and his wife, who teaches in Bridge City. Their house, her mother-in-law's house, and her aunt and uncle's house all flooded. And get this. They also were impacted by Harvey and Ike, but they feel like in this situation, it was much, much worse. We have the best students at Bridge City and my husband does at Deweyville. They come on their own and, and helping on their weekends off and their day off. Um, of course, I think every one of them is an athlete in some area, football, baseball, softball, cheer. Um, and we're just very grateful that they have uh, the big hearts that they have to come and, and help us out. Incredible to see their generosity as we watch the clean out process. I'm struck. We were talking about it at church this morning. And Kev, I know you and I have been visiting as well about this. I mean, we're so frighteningly good at this at this point. I mean, <laughs> knowing exactly what needs to go, how right? high to cut the sheetrock. Um, you know, we're, we're certainly um, sadly seasoned. Southeast Texans are pretty good at this thing of uh, digging out from uh, natural disaster, not to mention pretty tough folks. So that's pretty inspirational to see those young people yep. doing that. Oh, without a doubt. I'd be further inspired, frankly, though, if we had dry conditions.